Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. Alright, when we left off, we uh, were on our way to the ever so mysterious Christine at this point. On our way to try and figure out what the hell is going on. And I'm still discovering things that are making it difficult to traverse every few minutes. Oh yeah, this is the uh, superheated uh, knife, by the way. In case you were curious what the hell the glowing's about. That's what it is. Anyway, I figure I should probably pull this out now. Uh, is there a... Where is it? I have no idea where that beeping, you know, thing is originating. Oh, geez. I don't want to be running into the cloud, but at this point, it seems I have no choice. Uh, how do I get over there? That's the question. And I can't seem to answer it because I can't seem to find the way in. Maybe this way. It seems to be where I need to go. More or less. Ah, well, maybe I found it after all. Oh, what's that? Uh, sweet security pass. Okay. Well, I think I might have found the way in. I'll take that. That sure didn't help that guy, but, you know, I'll take it anyway. Or girl, or other. Okay. Ha! Huh. I can actually hear her talking. I assume that's her anyway. Because now that she's talking, as opposed to not... Uh, but that cross through real quickly. Ooh, oh, there it is. That's what was causing that. Oh, and this is locked. Fairly easy lock. Okay. Come on. There we go. Perfect. What the, uh, what the? How? How is there one of these? I assume this was like post-war, so how? Okay. What? <laughs> Why is there metal armor? What? It doesn't make any sense. How does that work? I'll take all these because they're right there, but what? The fuck? That doesn't make sense. So I could have sworn those were post-war. How am I poisoned by a cloud? It doesn't even come that far in. Damn it. Boy, I'm gonna look at all of this. Uh, there and there, that all works. Patriot's cookbook. Whoa, that's a lot of chips. Someone won big. Uh, Patriot's Cookbook. I think that is actually a skill book. Uh, nope, that's that's not a skill book at all. That's me being stupid. Uh, eyeglasses, don't need those currently. Uh, yep, I'll take those. And I'll take these, that's for sure. That, mm, yeah, I might as well. It's half you know, it's halfway to about a pound, so hey, that's good enough for me. Uh, curtain of cigarettes, absolutely. Up, oh, run through, up, oh, okay. Something about cigarettes. I have no idea, but at least I know that she's able to talk. It's always good to know. I'm going to do something <laughs> with this, all of these chips uh, that I don't really need. Uh, I can return that. Uh, there's a other, yeah, that. There we go. And what should I really do with it? Yeah, see, I have the uh, complimentary voucher ability to redeem chips, which is, that is a fuck ton. <laughs> that is far more than I ever earned on my own in here. Just so you're aware. That is quite a lot, and those are quite useful to have. Uh, I think I should probably get ten and do the rest in... Actually, probably not do the rest in rounds. That's the last thing I kind of need to do. Because uh, those weigh you down right quick. That's for sure. Whereas stim packs don't really do that, I think. I don't remember them doing that. All right. Let's go pass through here and back into this room over here. Just do a quick run 
Just to make sure I've checked everything that's around here. There we go. Got some of that. Got some of whatever this is. Fancy lad snack cakes. That's a good enough reason for me. And... There we are. Oh, I could actually redeem that, so I'll take that. Uh, what about here? That's uh, here, Madre Chips. I could definitely do that. Definitely do these. I'm starting to yawn. I apologize. Huh? <laughs> Jeez. Fucking sleepy. I only just woke up. And already I'm doing better than the last Fable episode. <laughs> Which is not that hard. Okay, and... Oh, I thought that was a emitter for that, uh hologram for a second and then I realized wait there's no holograms near me what am I worried about what the oh what what the um uh huh I don't remember it being human colors a little bit ago ah uh. Then, alright, okay, that's new, but okay, I ain't gonna complain, that's actually pretty good, I think, maybe, we'll find out, eventually, I should probably head this way, now that I think about it, uh, maybe not that directly, uh, this way maybe, okay, there we go. And I might as well return that outfit I found. Uh, immediately. Uh, there. Nope, I can return two of those. That's nice. And then I had a spring outfit, I think. Uh, yeah, I did. Cool. And that should be it. That should be everything. Your voice stolen, huh? Um, starting to think I should probably pop some, uh, stuff maybe like that that motherfucker <laughs> had to be that well at least I have enough to hold me until the end of the fucking area god damn it another one ah okay alcohol withdrawal takes away from charisma uh the intellect drop I can circumvent from booze. Uh, there we go. That's yeah, not a lot, but it's enough to at least make it so I'm nominal. Uh, at least I still have the perception up. Uh, dear. Check the rest, the rest of my stats if I can speak English. <laughs> All right, uh, food, not food, water. There we go. Perfect. Ish, kinda. Better than not, that's for sure. Uh, okay. Just making sure I have everything else I can do. Uh, yeah. Everything else, except, you know, not get addicted to Mentats. What is going on over here? Is she over here? Is she over here? Also, big book of science. Definitely take that. Big book of science! Alright, let's look at my skills for that. Uh, 70. I can make do with that, absolutely. Uh, that's not what I meant to do at all. I meant to go to items again down that and might as well take a food. Voice I don't think you, you meant made it. Good. Oh, uh huh? Just to talk. Yeah. This quick in case my voice goes out. Fair enough. Yeah, you sound like the woman in the Sierra Madre broadcast, if anything. Do I? Sounds off to my ears. Hard to tell. Well, it always does. Not to mention it. It hurts like hell to swallow. I bet. Might be why I got moved off to this suite. It's hers. Oh. That's her over there. Got trapped by security like I did. Just took a different way out. Oh. Now that your voice is back, what did you want to say? I've been hunting the one who hijacked your pit boy, Elijah, for some time. 
Really? He cannot leave the Sierra Madre alive. What he's done... What he's done here is nothing compared to what he's done in the past. The only I way to bet. bring him out is if you get to the vault. He won't allow you to go down there alone. That's when we kill him. Uh, how long have you been hunting him? I have a bit of knowledge in how long, but we might as well hear it from her. Too long. Thought I might have had a chance to settle it before this event happened. But then the chance slipped away again. Settle it? You're here to kill him. Those are my orders. I've seen what he's done, and I believe in those orders. You could have said something sooner. Wasn't sure until now I could trust you. Now I know. Fair Look, enough. When I woke up here, however that happened, I had this key on me. I think it belongs to her. Haven't had a chance to use it yet. Might open the dresser or the safe. Didn't have time to experiment with it before you arrived. Here you go. Fair enough. How did you get here from the gala event and onto this floor? The gala went off. The switching station opened up. I thought the screeching in the auto dock was bad. The station worse. Oh, geez. Got outside, saw the light show, and it was enough to make me run to the casino. Also, it seemed like the lights and speakers were helping to guide me. Guess your master wanted a backup in case you died. As for Maybe. being assigned to this floor. Maybe it's because of my new voice. Your guess is as good as mine. Maybe it recognized me as a guest. Does that auto dock there work? Because I have a few addictions I need to get rid of. Yeah, it's still functional. A lot of garbage data on it. Its basic procedures should still work fine. Good enough. Anything you can download off of it? I can see. Check the route. Recent diagnostics. A lot of medex was dispensed for... Vera Keys. Guess that's her corpse there for certain. Yeah. And why all those meds are scattered around in here. Probably. Here's the medical report. Looks like she had some sort of terminal condition. Oh. Diagnosis isn't conclusive. Must have been painful. I'm not even sure she knew if these medical reports are enough. She must have been numb most of the time. Fair enough. A drug addiction covering up a terminal illness. Tragic. Sheesh. Uh, can the autodoc heal your scars? No. They run a lot deeper than that. Figured that out. I was hunting Elijah in the Big Empty. He trapped me in one of those medical research centers buried there. It did something to my head, and I got off lucky. It's difficult enough to read now, and somehow the leap between what's in my head and words. It just ends up being a mishmash of symbols, not letters. Can still do math, formulas, equations, or writing poetries out. Fair enough. You said you got off lucky. Yeah. I saw records of other patients and what had been done to them. Some couldn't hear anything but static. Others just gibbering wrecks. Never going mm -hmm. back. And Elijah was on his way here, so I couldn't stop to see if it was something I could fix. If you can even fix what happened to me when they jabbed the electrodes into my skull and turned my head into a flashlight. Then I got here, and my voice got severed. Now I have a new one. Another thing Elijah has to answer for. Fair enough. And that definitely proves that she was also there in the Big Empty at some point. As well as Elijah, who we saw was eventually at that, uh, little, what was it, little Yangtze, uh, internment camp? Uh, yeah. He was running around with the bomb collars in there. That's probably why he knows so much of it currently out here. And I had some more questions I wanted to ask. Alright. I'm just glad I can answer you now. Yeah, me too. Uh... Apparently, it's not telling me up everything. Uh, glad you're safe. Hold up there. I can take care of Elijah. Good luck. He's not an easy opponent. If I can, I'll help. Might be able to figure something out using the Sierra Madre's computer systems. That would be nice. Uh, Mark 1 Auto Dock. Uh, cure exhaustion and heal all crippled limbs. So I can't do anything about can't do anything about the addictions. God damn it. Okay, I can open this up. 
sexy sleepwear. That's about what I expected. Um, uh, considering, uh, meeting people. There we go. Honestly, I expected to use the stuff I just downed. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, jeez. That's her dress, all right. And, uh, that is definitely more beautiful than I remember it being. Maybe it's because I'm doing it on the Xbox One now and the emulation is a little bit cleaner, but I don't remember it looking like that. Okay. Um, I'm just going to take the uh, meds around her for the time being. Fair skeleton. I can't do anything with... Okay. Absinthe. Nightstand. Thank you. Um, what's here? Queen of Clubs. Dead Man's Hand. Collected Sierra Madre's... Dead Man's Hand is an actual real life thing. Some of you are probably aware. But if not, it was... Ah, I don't remember everything off the top of my head. Uh, I'd rather not try and butcher the story. Alright, I'm just going to look through some things real quick around here. Feels like the cloud crawled in my mouth and died. That is quite a description. <laughs> and I don't doubt that that is probably accurate as far as you're concerned. Uh, anything else you have to tell me? You are she used sure. To want me here, collars and all. Not much for waiting around with a bomb around my neck. Uh, I need you here, so sit tight. I hear my collar beeping, though. I've got the route to the exit all mapped out. Fair enough, but that means I'm dead, and that will not mean anything good for either of us. Uh, ah, I could do this stuff. Create some drugs, or create some stim packs. Huh. I think I'm going to do some stim packs. There we go. Get that done. Uh, computer terminal. Wait, first. I just realized we had an audition tape from her. Uh, data. Your keys audition. Would you stop? <laughs> Such like a kidder. Crawled in my this mouth. is Vera Keys auditioning for Love Sets Sail. God, this script. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy to have the... Is that a plane overhead? Those bombers are nothing but big hornets buzzing around the sky these days. Is it gone? Alright. This is Vera Keys auditioning for Love Set Sail. Malcolm, ever since our freighter went down, I feel like my heart's fallen to the bottom of the ocean along with my... Ugh. Along with my career. God. <laughs> alright, alright. Yeah, I, I know how that feels like. <laughs> Trying to do the audition and you just don't feel it. I know how that goes. Alright, I think I need to open up this computer next. Um, unlock security door. There we go. There we are. And safe. Mimo me. What the hell are you doing? And another one of Vera Key's outfits. I cannot wear it, but I know someone who can! The elevator to the casino vault is locked. Find a way to open it. Fair enough. I think I know a way. Uh, vault elevator microphone. It's a voice recognition security system that protects access to the Sierra Madre's vault. Unlocking it requires a speak at the microphone with the proper voice. Which means... Christine, kind of need you now. You're back. Uh, I had some questions I wanted to ask you. Uh, I need to run through everything just so I can find the thing. Uh, jeebus, I can't find the voice. Okay. There's Try a chance he'll see reason. See what happens. He's so lost in his technology. I don't think he even understands why anymore. Fair enough. Um, I'm not getting the thing. That's a little annoying. 
Um, huh. That is a little odd. I guess I need to go this way. Huh. That's unusual. Usually I have all the parts here, so I didn't realize that I didn't. Huh. Alright, well, I'll run over here right quick, get the thing that I need. Uh, Sierra Madre Lobby. I didn't have all the parts before? You have the last fragment. That's oh. all I need. Now, go to the main lobby to throw the music sequence together. Okay. Uh, let's deal with this guy right quick. And he's taking all of those in stride. I just saw a fucking spear whiz past me. Oh boy. Let's just take another shot at him. That didn't work. Oh jeez. Ow. Okay, come on. A uh, couple more. That didn't do it. Of course not. Oh. Come on. Why is he taking every shot to the head like it's nothing? Okay. Okay, come on. And hopefully that does it. There it goes. Oh, jeez. Jeebus. Ah, Jeebus. Okay. I don't remember it being like that at all. Oh, jeez. Holy God damn. Okay, uh. Try and take this one's head off. And there we go. Oh, jeez. Okay, that's another one that I need to avoid. Because these ones are really strong. And there we go. That's not working. Well, backing up time goes. Woo! Woo, that was close. I'm going to reload. I cannot see a goddamn thing, and neither can you guys probably. Oh, jeez, you can probably only see the eyes, and that's really creepy. Oh, come on. That's one strike. That's a good strike. That one's less light. Okay. Ow. Ow. Okay, I'm going to pop some aid stuff real quick, including uh, Ghost Sight. That way you can actually see a little better than what I'm seeing. Good God. All right. I, I didn't realize I had like 200 of them. Uh, no, I didn't get that shot off. Fuck. Uh, headshot. Maybe that'll do it. Nope. Got a critical strike, though. Ow. Fuck me. Ow. Again. And almost there. Getting a little closer with every shot. Like this. There we go. Good stuff. And now we have three more. Four. Jesus, I'm going to try and blow that thing up. Oh, that worked a little better. I have like four of them still after killing like three. Jesus, okay. Oh, Jesus, uh, how am I supposed to... Okay, automatic rifle, there we go. Come on. Come on. Jesus. Oh, come on. There we go. That was four of them. Come on. There we go. And we have one more. I know that. And one shot to the leg should be enough. Maybe not. There we go. More like three more. But that worked out. That worked out. Slightly. I gotta thread the uh, sequence. <sighs> Alright. Exceptionist terminal. <sighs> Access music controls. Retrieve the ambient track. Ambient track and ambient track. Okay. Alright. Gain access to the Sierra Madre Vault. I could have sworn I could done it through a Christine the first time. At least I thought I could. Maybe that changed. I don't know. 
Uh, kind of starting to give out a little bit <clears throat> after all that running around. Yeah. Okay. Christine. Christine. Hello. 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 Are you high? You're back. I don't think you are. You sure you? I uh, found the phrase for the elevator's audio lock. I dealt with the others and I've got the key phrase. Okay. I found the phrase for elevator's audio lock. You did. Okay. Looks like even the old world can't keep you out when you've got a mind to get in. Yep. So, I just rasp out some words and the vault opens? Apparently. That woman, the starlet, she didn't build this place. Why would the builder do that? Because he was uh, in love with her? <laughs> ah. I have no idea. Let's unlock it. The phrase is contained in the lyrics to a song. Well, uh place i'm not sure it doesn't feel like a casino not entirely no the sealed doors the security it's almost a fortress that's true i think that's why we're being ordered to come here and crack it open uh, i guess it's the object of someone's obsession or affection love makes people do strange things yep won't argue that it can drive you crazy sometimes if you can't connect if they loved each other and they were together I suppose that's all that mattered. But she's in that side room, dead, because the casino wouldn't let her leave. And who knows where he is? Probably just as dead. <laughs> Begin again, let go. Oh, boy. All right. If you go down there, are you prepared? What if you don't come back? Uh, I've got you to come down after me. It'll respond to your voice. Uh, what does that mean? I just wanted to make sure you're ready. When you go down there, that may be it for us. We won't be needed anymore. The one who made these callers, he'll follow you down there. And he won't let you leave. He's not one for sharing. Never was. Fair enough. Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> there is something there, and I want a cheatsy doodle. I'll save it for the next episode. I'll I'll back up, try and figure out a way to get that to work. So, yeah, that's probably my fault. <laughs> I will probably need to pop some mentaps to get into that. So, there we go. Anyway, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and apparently being not perceptive enough for you.